all right guys today we are not doing the typical from scratch or just two or three ais we are making five ais work together to build subway surfers from scratch we got chat gbt 5.2 thinking model the newest one and you guys said it's really powerful and we have grok then we have the new co-pilot i've never used this before but you guys tell me to use it with think deeper and we have google gemini in the google ai studio this time so this is the most powerful version of using gemini because it could build things from scratch by itself so having that on board bro then we have Claude Opus 4.5. And we will be building Subway Surfers from scratch under an hour. So here's the timer right here. And yep. We're putting this all the way up to an hour long. That's a lot of time. So hopefully these five AIs can cook up in an hour. Let's start. And there it is. This timer is started. I need ChatGPT to make a good base model of Subway Surfers. Because then Grog, which I think is like on the same level, can improve it a little bit. And Copilot, which might be on the same level as well or better, can improve it a little bit as well. Then we got the big two right here. Google AI Studio will take it to the next level 100%. And then Claude will really just refine it. So I'm hoping we get an amazing game right here. And we could possibly put Google Ads on it and make a a bunch of money okay so i made chat gbt make me like a whole new prompt so i could feed it back to itself because my prompts are low-key bun we're gonna copy the prompt chat gbt gave me which basically tells it to use 3js and like no paid assets from the actual subway surfers so we don't get copyrighted and we're gonna keep on improving on the code that it gives us but thing is we'll use each ai to make their own prompt so they won't really be communicating with each other but they'll just be building upon each other and kind of working together go to work we'll put it on extended thinking too hopefully it doesn't make any mistakes scan to thinking that's why i like to now this is the new ChatGPT 5.2 thinking model so it is like slightly better than 5.1 and some of you guys even said that it's like night and day we're really about to see here hopefully it does not make a single mistake because it's been doing that recently bro it's like bro come on chat off for one minute and it's beginning to code all right while it's coding you guys might as well like the video bro i mean like and while you're down there hit that sub button too if you're new because if we could hit 100k by the end of this year i'll literally make ai recreate life one-to-one -one, i swear you guys think i'm joking i'm not but thanks to everyone who subbed right now bro we've been growing so fast ever since i created this from scratch series you guys just been showing love and i appreciate it so much I almost forgot hit that hype button too i get i think only mobile users could see it but uh but hit that bad boy so you could go number one in america i'm not gonna lie i've never seen chat gpt code this much it's been coding for like a solid three minutes now all right now it's done so let's copy this and let's see it's try to play it we're gonna call it subway serve html and we're gonna paste the code in here and let's run this bad boy on our browser all right here it is okay endless runner base original three lane endless runner subway surfer style mechanics smooth lane switching jump roll i like what i'm seeing in the background right now but let's play this bad boy all right start oh my god yo look at this guys oh my god so this is like subway surfers like theoretically space to jump okay that's an issue when i jump it only goes up like like it feels like i'm in the ground and then i i bring my body up when i jump but so far though this is good this is really good you collect coins yeah, it's really the jump feature, but you collect coins just like Subway Surfers. The roll as well when you go down. Wait, let's try to roll. This is the roll, bro. You just squish your body. The yeah, only thing that needs fixing is like the AI doesn't know how to put the actual player on the floor. It's like below the floor. But bro, this is amazing first rendition. ChatGPT, you actually cooked. I cannot believe this. This is the first roll. Oh, I still died, bro. I thought I rolled. ChatGPT 5.2 thinking is the best ChatGPT I've ever used so far. I'm not. I'm just so proud of ChatGPT. It's been laying me down every single video. It's really showing is true colors here and guess what we have four more ais to improve with this this is gonna be awesome all right let's take this and let's improve on it with grok so we're gonna take our file right here paste into grok all right so i wrote a prompt right here basically it's telling grok to make sure my jump feature work and also make the duck and roll feature actually work against its designated obstacle because when we rolled it did not work i'm gonna tell it to make a better prompt for me and i'll repost it into grok and then we'll see what how it goes from there all right it just completed the prompt to give to itself it goes into pretty good detail i just checked over it so let's paste all this and then let's uh paste it back into grok grok lets me down more than chat gbt bro that's gonna be crazy but chat gbt it just cooked up an amazing base for us all right let's, let's get into thinking oh it's already coding okay now this is the new grok 4.1 so let, let's see also we have to be mindful because the other ais we only have like 30 minutes left so i know google ai and claude they take a lot of time when they're thinking especially claude all right so it is done let's copy all this code and let's repaste it hopefully we get some actual improvements let's see what grok produced endless runner base okay same menu so let's start oh 
No way, Grok. You sold. Grok sold. It's not starting, guys. I promise you I'm spamming. I'm spamming start. Bro, Grok's is moving like Jesse at the end of Breaking Bad, bro. Just, just, just selling, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Let's put in expert mode because, you know, maybe it needs to just think longer. I'm just telling it to redo it because the game literally does not start. I'm telling it to not have any errors and go from the first file I gave it and not to improve on the one that it messed up on because it should, the game should start. It should just adjust the little things. So let's, let's give it that prompt. Hopefully expert mode saves us here trying to give these models max three prompts to use so we don't use up all our time so grok you only have one more prompt to use chat gbt ended up doing it in one prompt so i'm really proud of it man grok used to win these challenges and now it's it's doing worse than chat gbt that's crazy bro all right let's copy this and let's see if it actually you know gives us what we wanted this time and let's run it okay the background is the same this time so let's start and let's see if it improved i see that the player is above the ground this time too um Okay, it, it works though. The jump feature, I think I have to time it properly, but we're above the ground. Okay, yeah, we need to we need to jump way higher than this. Okay, this is definitely better, but we need to jump way higher than this because we're we're not clearing these obstacles, bro, off of one jump. Like so we oh I just cleared it. Never mind. Let me shut up. Okay, I just need to time it properly. So it actually works. Wow. Okay, here it is. Boom. Here it is. Boom. Let's go. Brock actually did it. All right, let's test the roll feature. Let's see if it fixed it. So these are things we have to roll on. Oh, let's go. Brock actually cooked up. It fixed all the errors that ChatGPT could not. Um, what are these orange things, bro? I think I just have to avoid them. They're like the um the canister things in Subway Surfers. Roll roll yo this is actually good all right so grok successfully made a good copy right here all right so the only thing we can kind of improve here is that we want someone chasing us 100 percent, and we want the jump to be a little higher because like the timing has to be perfect in the real subway surfers you don't really have to be perfect with it like you you clear it pretty easily it's only until like it speeds up a lot where it starts getting really hard so we only have 25 minutes left so next we have to go to co-pilot grok cooked up right there though it fixed every single air flawlessly so you know what i mean i can't be mad at it. so this is my first time using co-pilot but let's just tell it you know we're trying to improve subway surfers so we're just gonna tell us to make this prompt better i'm just telling it to make us jump higher so like we clear obstacles easier and i also told it to make an entity chase us kind of like the cop that actually chases you in subway surfers so hopefully you could do that i'm gonna send it i don't know how powerful copilot is but uh you guys hyped it up a lot in the comments and we're on think deeper mode so I'm, I'm just hoping it does really well here bro please all right so it just did our prompt right here and told itself what to do so that's good so it's gonna change all these things i'm just gonna tell it to use the prompt it gave us okay hopefully it could finish all this code in like under a minute because we only got like 20 minutes left bro okay so it just finished it, it did this in 47 seconds so it did what i asked here's the file let's open it and what is this copilot what did you just make us bro copilot what is this you just made it 2d yo this is actually making me <laughs> mad fuck this is copilot not that powerful no freaking way that she just made this thing 2d i don't even know what's going on we're going to the next ai we we need these two heavy hitters google gemini and claude we need we need to give it time copilot i'm just gonna count you as a fail bro you're the first fail so let's just ignore the code that copilot gave us let's use google ai studio for the first time this is gonna be awesome bro so we're just gonna tell it to basically just just try to really complete this project and if if this can't complete it then guess what claude will so you guys hyped up google gemini studio a lot so we're about to try it out let's tell it to build i just want to say right now i love the ui and just how it looks this thing really looks like it's built for programmers and i i like to see it oh my god it just fit it only thought for 26 seconds you guys can see it right here it called it subway runner i love the aesthetic that it gave it bro this thing coded this quick look at all the code oh i see what it did it turned into a react project all right let's tap to play i'm so excited to test this out all right let's go okay it's lagging because my computer but this is good bro yo bro do we have a backpack or something and those actually look like trains now i hit an obstacle i wait i didn't even see it wait am i tripping or did i didn't even hit an obstacle bro i like how it like counts up in the corner it's, it's more resembling of subway surfers okay it seems like when i'm trying to pass the train it counts as an obstacle let's try that again just to confirm either way it aesthetically looks better in my opinion the obstacles in the middle it counts it as in every lane let's let's fix that we can even play it on mobile that's fire wait tap to play yo so i'm just telling gemini you know when going past like a middle obstacle or a train it immediately kills me as if i collide with it so just, i'm just telling it to fix that and if it could just fix that feature we can give this to claude and obviously probably optimize it and then we should have just a full playable game bro all right so it is now done and now let's test it out it should work the roll is literally just a duck so that's cool all right, let's try to jump okay it works now 
nice nice so we don't freaking immediately die when we're next to something but yeah this is fine i'm honestly really fine with this it also counts the coins that we collect all right let's see yep we we can pass middle objects better anyways let's test this duck feature right here let me actually do it on time this time there it is all right it works google ai studio you improved it a lot gave it textures you know you gave it what it needed to give now we're at the big bad boy opus 4.5 which i paid a lot of money for do not let me down here and we only have seven minutes left so we have to cook this up fast but you guys need to do something fast too and that's to click the like button hit that hype button and subscribe right now so you can have good luck for the rest of your week and so you could uh you know become multi-billionaire just do it right now all right, let's drag it into here folder with all the files that google gemini just cooked for us i'm just telling it to improve our subway surfers clone game and to make it more like subway surfers pretty much so i'm just gonna tell it to make me a prompt right now hopefully it doesn't take the rest of his five minutes but i know you like to think bro all right so he gave me the prompt We're, we can't even read this because we don't have that much time but yeah let's paste this whole entire prompt and give it back to claude so let's just make a new chat and uh let's paste the files let's go thank you i hope you enhance this subway surfers clone let me start by extracting examining the current code base and understanding structure i'm not gonna lie yeah it only has 30 seconds left Claude, whatever you produce here it will be the last thing dang it, it it's working though I don't, you see what you see what i'm seeing it's working okay the time just uh, it just officially ran out so that's that's that bro God, bro you you've been coding for five five freaking minutes bro please finish bro please i need this claude i need this is. like you guys gotta really like think about it i'm just some guy sitting at his desk literally watching ai code i make videos watching ai code like bro this is freaking crazy i don't I actually don't know why you guys watch me but if you do i love you so hey we're here and i have a lot of clones that copy my exact editing style my exact video ideas bro it's it's crazy and honestly i'm honored you know what i mean yeah drop a sub if you think claude's about to cook here it, it's you know what i mean i'm just trying to buy time and talk to you guys because this thing has been going on for a minute like i actually don't know when it's gonna stop for you guys sake and this video's sake i'm just gonna come back to when claude is finished Okay, Claude just finished, and it actually took 13 minutes from the last time I just spoke to you, bro. We're just gonna test it out. We're just gonna cut to the chase, test this bad boy out. And this is Subway Servers, okay. The shadows, the coins look brown now. Why, is that, why are the coins brown? Okay, the jump feature is way smoother. It's, it's way smoother. That's that's something I could say. And I like the, the new high score screen when you die. That's pretty cool. Okay, okay. Our roll feature is still like us just squishing ourselves into the ground. It, it reversed the train models for some reason. It like regressed it, bro. It's like if I could combine this and the Gemini version, that would be the best version. Overall though, this is the end result. This is its improvements from Gemini. I actually like the old train models better. I don't know if that's just me. But you know, here's the roll feature that works. The jump feature works perfectly. Like the features work. Maybe it improved something. Maybe it saw something I didn't. You know what I mean? And improved that. But yo, this is this is good. This is a good Subway Surfers clone. These five AIs, they did their thing. I can't even lie. They did their thing in under an hour. Well, actually more than an hour. This took like an hour and 30 minutes in total. And this is our result, guys. So tell me what you guys think in the comments below. Make sure to subscribe. If you don't subscribe, I'm coming after you, bro. We're trying to hit 100K by the end of this year. Because this is just so fun. I just like, I've been receiving me so much love from you guys it's like bro like it generally makes me just want to keep doing this now comment down maybe the next game you want me to make and yeah i'll see you guys later